A woman walked into this advanced auto parts store on Sunday evening and told workers that she was being held against her will after meeting a man on a dating app. She was at the register and she came and told me, she said, uh, this guy sent me in to get an injury check, but he kidnapped me Saturday. And he had me ever since Saturday night because I met him on the app. She said he had a gun, so that's why we didn't want to try to lock in. We didn't want to try to shoot through the glass or anything like that. We blurred her face, but this surveillance picture shows the woman inside the advanced auto parts store in Dalton Sunday at around 5 in the evening. She walked in first and alerted workers that she was being held against her will. Yeah, she had some bruises on her neck, and she had a dog bandages around her finger. And... She was bruised, bloody, and bandaged, saying she met her kidnapper on a dating app. The workers tried to stall for as long as they could to call police. My co-worker was kind of stalling, but he told her to come on and get back in the car and let's go. But minutes later, this man walked into the store on Sibley Boulevard. He's been identified as the suspect by Dalton police, and he told the woman it was time to leave. That's when the quick-thinking workers wrote down the license plate. But they was pulling off. We had, uh, I, I told my co we're going to write the license plate number out. He wrote the license plate down, and he called the police from there. Dalton police enlisted the FBI to track the woman down. Police put out this picture of the white Chevy Venture with Illinois plates. It was registered to a woman. They were able to track it to a home in nearby Riverdale Monday afternoon. They found their suspect and the woman. She said she was hit over the head and tied up in the basement. Well, I'm just glad we can help, we can help somebody out and save from being harmed or anything more than whatever it happened to her already. That man was driving his mother's van. The mother was home when this woman was being allegedly held captive in her basement. She had no idea. As for the suspect, he's now in police custody, and that woman is being checked out at the hospital. Those charges could be coming against that suspect as soon as tomorrow morning. From Dalton, Tia Ewing, Fox 32 Chicago.